Finally, after all of your planning, design, and distribution, the best possible thing happens. A participant responds. Excellent. After all, if no one submits a response, your reports won't be too impressive. The least you can do is to say thank you. Once a participant clicks the Submit button, the response is recorded. Then what? Consider a few immediate post-survey options. A thank you page is a great way to confirm that the response has been submitted and to thank your participants for their time and feedback. Edit this message, including any additional follow-up or contact information you like. You may also set expectations about when or how results will be shared as appropriate. Depending on your requirements, you may choose to allow participants to reopen and modify their responses after they've submitted. Learn more about this option here. You may also choose to include chain invitations here. If enabled, participants will be able to enter email addresses and send new links to others they think might be interested in responding to your survey. Next, View Results can be used to display current results. This is best used for short surveys or topics that are not too sensitive. Consider whether displaying results here may impact or bias future participants. Finally, you may choose to redirect participants to a new static or dynamic URL after they have submitted. A static link will be the same for everyone, like your organization or project website. A dynamic URL might be based on a specific answer given by participants during the survey. No matter your decision, be sure your survey participants end on a good note. Set expectations, provide information, and of course, always remember to say thank you.